Okay, so in today's news, the Seahawks brought in defensive end Carlos Dunlap. He's a successful player, so it's a good addition. Psych! Let's go! We back. I know a lot of y'all thought it was over for the Seahawks. Our defense wasn't getting it together. Our defense was just going to hold us back the whole season. But I told y'all, we were going to make these moves. And once we make these moves, we're complete. We could still, you know, have some room to grow, get another defensive lineman because our defensive lineman's really bad. But we're the top dogs now. I don't care. 17 sacks from Dunlap in the last two seasons. 6'6". Six, six. Big fella can tip stuff at the line. That's what we need. I know y'all want to call us one of the worst defenses in the NFL, but Jamal Adams has been out, and we still only lost one game. And in that one game, we were on the road to a really good team, and we led the entire game. All we need is a low pass rush. That's all we've needed. Russell Wilson, he played his worst game of the season. He threw two horrible picks. That's not going to happen again. That's not going to happen in the big moments. And we got a little pass rush now. It's over. I know I gave you the, the Buccaneers the edge for this week because as being a better team right now because they brought Antonio Brown. I made my little reaction to Antonio Brown going to them. I was upset by it. But we didn't need him. We don't need him. DK is about to go off again. Y'all see Lockett. Y'all see Russell. All we needed was a little pass rush. Jamal Adams coming back. Jamal Adams was gone that game too. Y'all want to think that we're... It's going to be the demise of the Seahawks now? No, sir. We're winning 13 games. Simple. We're winning the West. We're getting the bye. We're getting that top seed. Because once Jamal Adams gets back... We've got a pass rusher now, and we're going to have Russell Wilson fo refocus on not making those mistakes. Oh, it's over for y'all. Chris Carson getting back healthy. He was out too. Oh, man. Y'all are so happy that y'all snuck away with one win on us. But we back. Dunlap, he's making his presence. You, we, we've not, you know, we're not done yet. We've, we're, our defensive line... It's, it is real bad. That is our worst part. You know, we might need to bring in even another one. But this is big moves. Some of y'all going to have to tell me about the lineman that we traded away. The offensive lineman, the center, B.G. Finney. I don't know if that's about him. I used to know about offensive linemen and stuff when I played Madden and I knew the roles and all that. But I don't know how bit Finney's bad. I should look into that and see what that loss is. But all I know is we needed that defensive pass rush. And Carlos Dunlap, I know about that dude. And he's still only 31. He's not past his prime. He's got it. That's all we needed. Now, Buccaneers, it's over for y'all. We win in this West. It's going to be, or this NFC, it's going to be us and the, and the Chiefs in the finals because Russell Wilson, he's just got it over Brady now. It's his time. Rumple Stillskins. Russ Diculous. We got this. Keep making moves. It ain't over. But this is what we needed. This was all we're missing. Ooh, we've got the run game. we got Chris Carson. We've got playmaking safety Jamal Adams. I like Shaquille Griffin back there too. I like Bobby Wagner as linebacker. You know, our defense isn't perfect. We've got some holes. But our offense, when Russell's not throwing those picks... Ooh, we gonna be tough to stop because this is the first time they're letting him cook. He's had one game where he threw some bad picks. Every other game, he's been dominant. And he was dominant this game, just a couple bad mistakes. Y'all don't want to see us. Y'all not matching up with DK and Tyler. You gotta choose your poison. Pick your poison because that little man Tyler will make those one-handed catches. DK will... If you don't put a big, dominant corner on him, he's going up. He's making plays. And defensively, that's all we need. We need a guy that can put pressure on the quarterback. We need to be able to put pressure with four because we haven't been able to do that. We've had to blitz Jamal Adams and stuff to get any type of pressure. So now, now we have the ability to get pressure with four. Even if he's not getting the sacks and people can just focus on him, he'll open up other guys to have a chance. Hopefully we can bring in one more decent line that can get us a pass rush and we'll be complete there. Now we've got a great linebacker, a great safety, nice corner, and as bad as our defense has been basically since Legion of Booms left, our defense hasn't been very good. Every year it gets better as the season goes along. I think we got some good coaching, we got those turnover Tuesdays, you know, we got we got good rituals in the Seahawks. 
and we back. Let me know what y'all think. We just we just made the move. I was telling y'all we were making these moves and we're skying up now. Let me know y'all thoughts. Yes, sir. Like, subscribe, all that.